The iPhone SE 2022 is just over a year old now, and I recently picked up another one. I'm using it as my daily driver for my iPhone. Replaced my iPhone 14 Pro Max, actually, which uh, I'm happy about because I really had a lot of issues with it. But this is always my favorite form factor. I like Touch ID. The camera, it's decent. I mean, it's definitely not a bad one at all. And easy, compact form factor. I got the 128 gigabyte storage model. And it's a great option for a lot of people who have kids or who just don't want the big, expensive $1,000 iPhone and still want access to all the Apple services and everything else. But I still think it's a great phone, even in 2023.